Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are diving into a detailed comparison between two popular Linux distributions, Kubuntu and Linux Mint. Whether you are a seasoned Linux user or just starting your journey into open source, this video will help you decide which distro might be the best fit for your needs. Overview Let's begin with a brief overview of each distribution. Kubuntu is an official flavor of Ubuntu that features the KDE Plasma desktop environment. It combines the robust foundation of Ubuntu with a modern, highly customizable interface. Linux Mint, on the other hand, is known for its user-friendly design and comes in several editions, with Cinnamon being the most popular, along with matte desktop environment and XFCE options. It focuses on ease of use and a smooth out-of-the-box experience, especially for those transitioning from other operating systems. Now let's talk about the desktop environments and user interface. One of the main difference between these two lies in their desktop environments. Kubuntu utilizes KDE Plasma, which is visually appealing, feature-rich and highly configurable. It offers a polished look with advanced customization options, ideal for users who love tweaking every detail. Linux Mint typically uses the Cinnamon desktop. Cinnamon provides a more traditional and straightforward user interface that feels familiar especially to users coming from Windows. Its design prioritizes simplicity and stability, making it a great choice for everyday use. Both options deliver a unique user experience. Your choice will largely depend on whether you prefer a modern, dynamic interface or a more classic, easy to navigate desktop. Now let's talk about the performance and system resources. When it comes to performance, Kubuntu KDE Plasma is known for balancing aesthetic appeal with efficient resource usage. Recent improvements have made Plasma lightweight. But some advanced visual effects may still use more resources compared to other environments. Linux Mint is generally lauded for its speed and stability. The Cinnamon desktop is optimized for a smooth performance on a wide range of hardware. Though users with very low spec systems might consider the matte or XFC editions instead. Both distributions are well suited for modern hardware, but your specific use case whether you need eye-catching effects or absolute performance might tip the scales. Now let's talk about the software and package management. In terms of software management and repositories, both Kubuntu and Linux Mint are based on Ubuntu, which means they share access to a vast repository of software. However, Kubuntu integrates seamlessly with the KDE ecosystem, offering a suite of applications designed to work perfectly with Plasma. Linux Mint includes a range of pre-installed utilities aimed at providing a complete multimedia and productivity experience right out of the box. Its software management is also known for being exceptionally user-friendly. Ultimately, both systems offer robust software ecosystem. So it's really about the type of applications and user experience you prefer. Now let's talk about the community support and updates. Community and support are critical when choosing a Linux distribution. Kubuntu benefits from Ubuntu extensive community and official support channels, along with dedicated KDE forums and resources. Linux Mint has built a loyal following known for its detailed documentation and active community support, which is particularly helpful for newcomers. Both distributions receive regular updates and have strong communities behind them, ensuring that you will have plenty of help and resources available. Now, final thoughts and recommendations. To wrap things up, here are some key points to consider. Choose Kubuntu if you are excited by a modern, highly customizable interface and enjoy the KDE ecosystem. Go for Linux Mint if you prefer a familiar stable and user-friendly experience that requires minimal configuration. Remember, the best way to decide is to try both. Live sessions or dual booting can give you feel a real feel for each environment. Let us know in the comments 
which one you lean towards and why. Thank you for watching. If you found this comparison helpful, please like, subscribe and share this video. Stay tuned for more Linux tips and comparison in upcoming videos. Peace out.